really excited. This is episode one. And today is five and five. I'm with Sherry and Dan Wild. And I'm going to ask five questions to them. And they get to knock me out with five questions as well. We can pass on a question. That's not happening. Okay. <laughs> all right. All right. Okay. That sounds good. But I'm going to set five minutes on the clock. Let's and do it. We're going to kick it off. Here it goes. All right. So I've seen on social, the bios, everything that you two are the wild dynamic duo. And what's something that you'd love to share with the audience that we probably don't know about you? Ooh, that's a, that's a good question. I mean, we met in high school. We met in high school. We've been dating for, we just celebrate, wait. 28 years. 20, 28 years. Um, What else? Uh, Sherry was a special ed teacher used to teach kids with disabilities. And what did I do? You used to sell long distance. Oh, that was a long time ago. <laughs> Telephone services, door to door. Yeah. I did that too. I was well, not door to door. Yeah. But yeah, it was, it was, it was interesting. Um, we live in Wauwatosa and we're two kids out of West Dallas. Hey. All right. <laughs> All right, Willis. Your you turn. Ready? Your question. Oh yeah. Okay. Do you want to do it? Sure. Go ahead. Describe your perfect day. My perfect day is me waking up at 10 a.m., having a delicious cup of coffee, preferably at Starbucks, as you know me. Then I'm probably kicking it off with some Mariah Carey in my eardrums because I have to really hear her first album to really get my day going. And the weather cannot be over 78 degrees. Okay. Probably we're pushing like 50% humidity and really BSing with all my friends and getting an opportunity to be creative, whether that's taking selfies or running around walking and taking photos. It's really just an, a creative mental health day for me is what recharges my battery and allows me to do what I do. And I think that's the most rewarding for me. That sounds like a wonderful day. Let's put it on the calendar. I want to do it. <laughs> you want a Mariah Monday with me? Mariah <laughs> Monday. That could be today. Yes. yes. It, it technically is. I All listened right. to it this morning. Yes. All right. So, so you're married to the biz. You're married to each other. Okay, so like, what's the secret to keeping things harmonious? Ooh, what's the secret? The secret? Uh, um, the secret to keeping things harmonious. Staying calm? Yeah. Uh, as long as he does what I tell him to do? Yep, that's true. Mm -hmm. um, putting, I think, I think the key to our relationship is putting, always making sure that the relationship between the two of us is at the core of everything that we do and there's no personal like there's no no like no one's above the other yeah no one's above the other absolutely it's like we are a team we are in both real estate together and life together and there that that team is there's nothing more important than that team like none of the bull that happens in life is worth you know disrupting the team right yeah, that's probably it. Solid answer. Yeah. It's, give, it's giving 50, 50 balance. I love it. Yeah, it's it's being just committed to the team. like Taking care of each other. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. There you go. That's our... Uh, All right. Yeah. Um, okay, uh, so when you have a really tough day, what's one thing you do to get through a really hard day? Um, I reach out to a bestie. Um, I definitely have to talk it out. Um, if it's a not, if it's a moment where I'm like, oh God, I'm upset or angry or you know something like that, I I always take a 24 hour cool down because I think it's best for all parties that you know like hey like let's step back from this and revisit when things are cool. Um, but I probably have to say I'm a bit of an emotional eater, so I probably order some like upper crust. <laughs> oh, nice, perfect, <laughs> perfect. That's great. That's yeah. all right. Good advice. So since you talk about 50-50 team, you know, all that good stuff, um, what advice would you give to other couples who want to team up as a real estate duo? Ooh, we get with, that. We get that question. With one minute left on the clock. All right, go. Cool. I figure out what you both are really good at and you focus on those things. And you, I'm, I'm good at some things, he's good at some things. We don't cross paths. We stay in our lane. And we just know. We know, hey, you, you know, you're good at this. I'm good at this. We don't have to talk about it. We just... When things come in, we know exactly who handles what, and there's no question. We get her done. You got to figure that out. And not just in All work, right. but in life. Word. Yeah. All right. Your question oh is, mm -hmm. if you could choose to be a famous person for a day, who would it be and why? Oh, I thought I was going to be famous. Um, <laughs> for one day, um, 
somebody else, I would be Mariah Carey. I want oh, worldwide yeah. stardom. Gosh. Perfect. Okay. So let's talk Teach Twizzle really quick. 15 seconds. Yeah. How was the era's experience for you? Oh man, best concert best ever. Concert Taylor ever. Swift. Oh, it was such a great show. I want to do it again. I mean, we're trying to like find a place somewhere else in the world to do this. It's amazing. <laughs> Gotta go see T Swift, everybody. That's oh, the five minutes. Oh, that was fast. That was five minutes. It's really it's four. I mean, when you think about it, it's not five <laughs> for five, it's ten for five, because there's ten full questions. True, true. There's ten questions, but there's there's yeah, challenge somehow. Are we gonna do the now we can do the extended <laughs> version? <laughs> okay. Yes, absolutely. Because I really want to get my last question in with you, and okay. because you didn't hit the five and five, we're gonna do another one. We'll have to do another one in the near yeah. future, just because you know we love you. So we gotta hear from you. Oh. Um, but what's your question? Last que okay, we question. Okay, question. My two qu uh, two more were. Oh yeah, yeah. you do. What was your favorite thing to do when you were 10? Oh my God, 10 Ooh. was probably my my Mighty Morphin from Power Rangers era. Ooh. <laughs> and I one. was so confused about Power Rangers because I was like, do I want to be the Blue Ranger today? The Red Ranger because he's the leader or do I want to be the Green one because like he started out bad, but then he was good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> more or less, I was usually between being the Blue Ranger and the Green Ranger. So, um, yeah, that was like, I would go outside and go crazy. I I would be running through my yard and for any object I could find, I would consider that like my weapon of choice, how I was going to do that, you know, save the day. Don't we wish <laughs> we all could go back to being 10 again? Oh, God. It would be amazing. It would be. Um, it would be. All right. Yeah. So my last question for you, yep. if you could jump back in time and speak to your newly licensed selves, what advice would you give yourself? Newly licensed. Um, what advice would we give ourselves? Um, read Ninja Selling. I mean, that that was like the book that we read that like it all clicked for us. I mean, we've read it. So, I mean, we did that. Um, boy, Gosh, I would say it's going to be OK. It's all going to be OK. It's all going to be OK. <laughs> Take the leap. This isn't you'll that. You'll figure out. You'll, the parachute will show up. As long as you are trying to help people, you'll be fine. As long as you're trying to help people. Yeah. If you're doing this for any other reason, for money, for, to, 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 I don't know, whatever, you, you might do okay. But I think if you have, at the core of it, focus on just trying to help people, it'll make everything easier. That's it. That's awesome. That's what I would tell Yay. her. You won't believe where you're at in three years. Yeah. That's what I would tell our younger selves. You wouldn't believe the life that you have, right? Yeah. And the people you get to meet, like yeah. Willis. And when Keller Williams comes uh, for it. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So you get, to, you get to wrap it up with your question. All right. Here you go, Willis. Here's your last question. If you had the whole world's attention for 30 seconds, what would you say or do? The whole world. Oh my God. Six the and a half. Whole the whole world. world. For how, how many seconds? 30, 30 so you only seconds. get 30, 30 seconds. seconds. 30 seconds with the world. Mm -hmm. Um. Oh you my know. God. That's an impossible. Would, would you say something? What would you say? What would you say? Uh, or do. I think I would have to do something and that would probably be something that would make me and make a memorable oh man that's everybody's so hard, hard. oh make everybody <laughs> smile yeah i definitely can do that i can definitely you know i think i would spend that 30 seconds like pouring some love back into yeah. the world because i think that's really something that is missing yeah. right now you know you, everyone's different everyone has their way of living and everything but you know what that doesn't mean i have to hate you that yeah. means like you know what i just need to understand you and make a you know a bridge or you know connect in one way or another and i think that people just forget to love love your neighbor love your friends love your family all of it i think that it doesn't feel like there's a lot of love out there right now i think that's right. what the world means so that is what i would do that's what you would do right. yeah when i when i read that question i thought let's all just take a deep a big deep breath take a couple for for one for 30 seconds everybody just breathe and just everybody Chill calm out. down yeah, you just relax. Jeez. We're all just here to try to help this time. <laughs> yeah. Amen. Yes. Okay. So that yeah. is our five and five. 
I'm so excited that we actually did this at your episode one, like I said. But uh, yeah. looking forward to doing another one, and hopefully we uh, see if we can hit that challenge. Yeah, Five minutes. absolutely. Yeah, this Five was Five questions. So, this, was, this was dress Yeah, exactly. This season was, one is uh, not as good as season two. That's, uh, you know, it just keeps getting better. And you we'll guys, we're, I'm so glad we got to kick it off together because, yeah. You deserve those extra bonus minutes. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much, Willis. This was so much fun. Thanks for having me. Um, Thank you so Bye. much, Willis. Bye. <laughs>